While Nigerians reflected on the political intrigues that have shaped the nation for over 20 years, some expressed disappointment, others were hopeful on the nation's progress. Democracy is about free election. It's about having peaceful election. It's about getting credible candidates to contest for elections. It's about not having talks to carry ballot papers and ballot boxes. It's about people appreciating that election also has high value of life. So Nigerians are not Democrats. Nigerians are people that want to have their way. And because as an individual, every Nigerian wants to have his way, is also impacting on the way we have also come to appreciate democracy, even as we're celebrating June 12th. Considering the struggles of the late Moshud Kashima Wu Lawali Abiola, it is said that what has not been perfected is the winner takes it all phenomenon where an election is won and contenders accept the will of the people. Not uh, declaring a day democracy day without doing the right things under a democratic governance, uh, for me, it's a minus. If you are now under a democracy, the expectation will be that you do things that would give vent to those things that we thought will have been, will, will, will have been lost, you know, by not realizing the ambition in 1993. Given religious differences in a heterogeneous society such as Nigeria, Baba Gana Kingibe and Moshu Dabiola were both Muslims contesting for the nation's number one and number two seats respectively but it got an overwhelming support from the people. The submission is, if any political party wins an election, it should be a government of national unity that will add value and build the nation. I think um, fundamentally, um, celebrating June, June 12 is in itself a huge achievement. Um, not just for this government, not just for the man who has the power and the courage to acknowledge that mistakes were made with the annulment. But also because it is something that is starting the process of healing, of healing some of the wounds that this country or some sections of the country suffered over time. Those who witnessed the June 12 election have been impacted in one way or the other by the struggles of MK Uabiola. Perhaps the next step is to ensure that citizens, regardless of class, collectively add value to the nation's uninterrupted democratic governance. I do not think that um, uh, President Muhammad Buhari uh, believe in the ideas that the late chief M.K. Abiola lived and died for. June 12, and chief M.K. Abiola have come to represent true democracy, credible election, freedom of speech, and all the major ideals of democracy. Everybody has got to become a Democrat for us to have a democratic culture and a democratic system. If you are not a Democrat yourself as a person, you cannot have that which you wish for. <laughs>